Hey, Hillbillies. So, on Reverb.com, there is an Amazon Basic Drive pedal, a $26 pedal, listed, listed for a million dollars. I don't know what kind of a joke it is. Obviously, it's some kind of a joke. I, I don't know. The thing about it is, is that um, in the listing, it says only Jeff Bezos can buy the pedal. So, you know. I mean, I know Josh from JHS did the half million dollar Klon pedal, and, and so I think someone's just trying to get, I don't know, some free news or something, you know. I mean, but it's just ridiculous. I mean... What else could, you know, be, be more ridiculous? But in the listings, this is the listing. Rare Amazon Basic Drive Pedal. These pedals are no longer for sale on Amazon, reads the listing. This one has been disassembled for inspection, then reassembled. Because of this, the rubber feet on the bottom have been removed and not included. Works great. This pedal is only for sale to Jeff Bezos. If you are not Jeff Bezos, please don't buy it. And I guess the listing also says it's predicted to sell soon because someone has it in their cart. I mean, really? I mean, is this, I, I don't know what it is. Is this Amazon like trying to, to get some um, free advertisement like they needed for their Amazon battle? Crazy, you know? I mean, you know, the clown going for half a million dollars. <laughs> I mean, here's the thing. If it's the first clown, which Josh says it is the first clown. I watched it. He says it's the first clown. If you owned, if you were the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, you know, you could see, you know, like, you, you would want that pedal. I mean, seriously, I mean, that pedal... I mean, I have two Klon clones on my board, and I'm always looking for another Klon clone. You know, I love that sound. But uh, I don't think anybody is seriously in love with the sound of the Amazon Drive pedal, which, you know, I mean... Who knows even who makes those? Any, you know, I know some of the first ones were made by Nux or Nuex. I'm sorry, but I don't think they were after that. Well, they're probably made in the same factory, but they didn't have the the Nux logo or Nuex logo on it. But uh, you know, you know, anything is wor worth whatever someone is willing to pay to get it. I understand that, and that you know that is. That's the way of the world, you know. If you're willing to pay it, you know, then it's worth, uh, you know. But really? A million dollars for an Amazon basic pedal? You know, it's not something that was handmade by some guy in Boston in the 90s that, you know. I mean, everybody, I mean, everybody plays one now. I mean, I, I know I've seen, like, the guys from Social Distortion, they got one in their, you know, pedal board. Uh, Bruce Springsteen, I think, plays one, I heard. You know, who wouldn't want one, you know? I mean, it's just one of those pedals, I think, you know? Everybody, everybody, I don't know. I, I love them, so anyway. But the Klon and the Amazon Basic Pedal are not anywhere near in the same party line you know what i'm saying it's not a tube screamer that you know cv ray vaughn used to have on his pedal board in the 90s or something it's a 26 dollar pedal from amazon I, I can't even get a, a a one terabyte sd card for my phone to do videos for you know on Amazon with a five-star rating. <laughs> yeah, they want a million dollars for this. Anyway, I just wanted to do this video and tell you guys about it. If you didn't know, look it up. It's on Reaver. I think Guitar World has a, a, a thing on it. So, yeah. Yeah, just, you know. I don't know. Let's see what's next. I mean, it's kind of funny. I, I did get a laugh out of it. I hope you guys got a laugh out of it. All right, thanks. I'll talk to you later. Cheers.